Good morning everyone! I probably shouldn't be starting the vlog while the kettle is still boiling. Okay, kettle finished boiling, but now the washing machine is going. Anyway, it is what it is. Hi everyone! Welcome back to the channel. I know it has been a hot minute. There are bags everywhere. <sighs> I'm going to tidy up the kitchen, okay? It's a mess. Um, but yeah, I haven't vlogged for you guys in the last couple of weeks because things have just been so crazy. I had a Woolies Diwali campaign. If you guys watch my Instagram, that was like so crazy. Um, but I was so blessed and so honored to be a part of the campaign. It was so amazing. Um, the timeline was a bit tight because Diwali was like on Monday, the 24th of October. So... You know, we had to crunch down, get all the content out before Diwali. Um, so yeah, that was a bit stressful, not gonna lie. I wonder if I should go like further away from the washing machine. Okay, so yeah. Um, yesterday was an activation with Revlon. Uh, we got chain matched to the new formulated um, Color Stay Foundation. I think now it has hyaluronic acid in it. You know, we love some good hyaluronic acid. Um, and yeah, it's just been so crazy the last couple of weeks guys. I just have not had the capacity to vlog and get all my work done in the day um, And yeah, I'm telling you when you are busy, it's like There's more that gets added onto your plate that makes you Become Almost more stressed. So say for example like this week is a heavy work week and then you have responsibilities as an aunt as a sister as a daughter so it's just rough sometimes um, but like everything happens at the same time and then you know you yeah no it's just rough um, and also I don't know why nobody takes into account the fact that when you are running a household that takes up half of your time especially if you don't have a helper every single day it's just a lot. It's a lot of responsibility for a single human being to do all the time. But um, it it doesn't feel like a lot of responsibility when you're not overwhelmed. But when there's just so much going on, you're just like, oh my god, I need to wash those dishes in the sink. But I got so much work to do. Like, which one takes precedence? The work, not the dishes. So yeah, it's just been a lot. It's been a little bit overwhelming. Um, but other than that, it's been good. I've been trying to prioritize time for myself and really take time for myself but it's really hard when you when you know if you don't work no money comes in so yeah i've just really been trying to like strike a good balance try to figure everything out and just really try to manage my time better you know but it's kind of hard sometimes and i feel like even though I've been living alone now for like five months, it's still quite crazy. Like when I tell you I did not have time to do laundry last week and the week before that. Like on a Monday, I woke up, I needed to go get content sorted, needed to go sort stuff. No time for laundry. And then the other Monday was Diwali. So I had to do oil bath, all that stuff. And then I had to go do some work with Sorbet. So it's like where was the time for laundry then so i'm doing laundry now it's another normal monday it's just been crazy when i tell you it's been crazy it's been so crazy so just know that when there's no content it's not that i'm being faulty it's not that i'm being some type of way it's just that i am at my wits end and i just do not have the time to sit and edit youtube videos youtube videos sometimes it's like one and a half hours Sometimes if I'm lucky, I'll get like 45 minutes of footage, but it still does take a while to sift through all of that. And yeah, guys, it's just crazy, but I'm back. Hopefully, um, I think I haven't uploaded in two weeks at this point in time. Um, I am going to try to... Um... I'm gonna try to um, 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 edit 
content that I already have. I started editing the vlog the other day and I just didn't finish. Um, and then I want to post more content to Instagram because I've also kind of taken a little bit of a step back in terms of posting a lot on Instagram. Um, it's a lot, guys. When you're constantly running three different uh, platforms, Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, to be on the ball creating content consistently all the time is rough um so i'm kind of getting into a space where i am you know creating content like makeup content again for instagram for tiktok um i do get ready with me's on tiktok which is nice i do quite a bit of fun stuff on instagram so yeah, I mean, my Instagram is mostly mostly paid partnerships, okay? I, I'm so blessed. I'm so grateful. Today, I am grateful for... I was watching Sailor Dean's stories. Today, I am grateful for all the work that comes my way. Sometimes it's overwhelming. Sometimes it's very chaotic. That's why I don't, like, upload vlogs. But it's still so rewarding at the end of the day. Also, today, I am embarking. It's the 20, 31st of October. I'm embarking on a weight loss journey. I've been eating like junk for the last month or so, especially after fasting. So I need to like clean up my diet, stop eating so much of chocolates and sweets because it really like shows in your belly area. So, and I've been eating lots of carbs. So I'm also going to start eating a little cleaner, take you guys on that journey with me as well. And yeah, it is November. I'm not going to promise you guys Vlogmas. I am not going to promise you guys Vlogmas, guys, because wow, Vlogmas is a lot of work. I know we make it look so easy, but it's a lot of work. Don't get it twisted. Um, I'm not going to promise Vlogmas yet. I'm going to get my life in order. I'm going to put this battery on charge, and then I also ordered some Christmas deco. So when we come back after this battery is charged and after I've dried my laundry, I'll show you the Christmas deco. It's coming at half past 10, I think. Now it's half past 9, so it will come in the next hour because I ordered it last night on Checkers. I really don't like going to the shops, guys, please. Okay, so we had a little bit of a spanner in the works. There's my clip that I was using to clip my hair back. Found it. So I had to, the time right now is seven minutes past 11. Just finished drying out my second load of laundry. The good thing about summer clothes is that it doesn't quite pile up like winter clothes. Anywho, so the stuff that I ordered from Checkers, maybe it actually was a silver lining, hey? Maybe it was a silver lining because the stuff I ordered from Checkers didn't end up coming. So <clears throat> the tinsel and the little Christmas tree that I ordered didn't come. So I went to Mr. Price home in the midst of this battery charging and all that stuff. But I need some coffee, guys. But before we move on to anything else, I need some coffee. If I don't have coffee, I'm not going to function. So let's get into it, shall we? Also, how stunning is the Starbucks cup? I love it so much. I mean, guys, come on. It is stunning. Here's what I bought from Checkers. I just bought some Christmas gift wrap. I always need some gift wrap, okay? And then I got this. I feel like it's tinsel, but like the green Christmas tinsel vibe. And then I also got. <coughs> I ordered a gold one like that, but it was out of stock. And I ordered, what else did I order? Um, yeah, so I ordered a mini Christmas tree with the bulbs, but maybe it just wasn't meant to be, you know? And then I also ordered these lights, Santa's Choice as well, 20 battery operated LED lights. Oh, they're so cute! It didn't come with the batteries, just so you know. It did not come with the batteries. So I'm thinking what I actually might do is maybe put this 
tinsel by the TV you know I don't know I bought some cute deco stuff today um, I did, did I need some of it no did I buy it anyway yes I did okay the first thing I didn't need kind of gonna be another episode of the home series Christmas edition <laughs> so oh wow so somebody asked me the other day when are you gonna upload another home series and I said I have no idea when because there's nothing pretty much else I could talk about or do but now it's Christmas so actually so I love how when you go into Mr. Price home they always take care of your goods so I bought this plant. I bought this plant is like a monstera, fake monstera leaf, guys. I'm going to be completely honest right now. My parents and my sister have green fingers. Me, on the other hand, I'm not quite sure that I have acquired the green finger bug. Um, so yeah, I I just uh, I'm just really bad at keeping plants alive. Um, my orchid died and my other plant that my cousin gave me well it's not dead the flowers just fell off because you know the thing is with like flowery plants is that from time to time the flowers fall off and the orchids fall off and then they rebud or they re stem or they re like pollinate so I'm keeping the orchid because I have a feeling it's going to rebud um, apparently the, the orchids go through these phases where they like die out or the flowers fall off and then they come back anyway so yeah I really wanted some greenery in the house um, so I bought this for my little side desk nook situation I think it's gonna be a nice um, little addition this is what it looks like this was very expensive I don't think I looked at the price properly when I bought that anyway so next we have some more tinsel. Um ooh, two meters. This tinsel was 46 rand. That plant was 400 rand, guys. Do y'all need it? No. Did I need it? Yes, I did. Um, okay. So this is the tinsel. It's so cute. It's like two meters of tinsel. And then I've also I also bought this little angel. How cute is that? Oh, that is so cute. This was 99 by 99. A shine angel. Like a glittery angel. I love it. I had to I had to bring it home. It's so cute. Um then I got some bottles for the Christmas tree. I'll show you guys the Christmas tree just now. Um this is a 25 piece metallic bald so I got red and I got gold because I thought hmm the Christmas tree is green so I got red and I got gold to break up the green and then I also got these bottles so these were 130 red each so it actually wasn't it wasn't horribly pricey I thought it was gonna be way more expensive it wasn't that expensive at all and I bought a small Christmas tree so I don't want to buy big bottles um, but I did get these lights these are string lights um and they're battery operated so that is great because i do have batteries for these uh, these were 200 rand and then lastly i bought this gold tray so you guys know in my little cutesy area over there i have a silver tray and I thought, okay, you know, I'll go with mixed metals because at the time I didn't realize that the mirror was going to end up being gold. I thought if I couldn't get gold, I'd settle for silver. So that's why I ended up getting a silver tray. But um, yeah, it's not like these trays will never come in handy. They're mirror trays. Um, they're really, really good for decor. Um, so yeah, I got a gold one. I do have a silver one like this, but I got a gold one just because I feel like it's going to work so much better in my little area i'm gonna redo that area um and yeah you guys will see when i'm resetting that area so yeah i really like this i think it's really stunning 
um, and I think now everything is going to be so cohesive because my side table is a gold, the mirror is gold, um, now this is gold, so yeah. I mean, the other silver one's not going to go to waste, so it's not a big deal. Let's put some batteries in this. Oh, I need to show you guys the Christmas tree. Hold on. Tanesh, why did you just get such a small, such small bubbles? It's because I got a really small Christmas tree. This is like a 1.5 meter Christmas tree. I'll tell you how much it was. 280 rand. 280 rand and the size is 1.5 meters okay I'm one I'm 1.59 <laughs> this is uh oh my god 1.5 why did I feel like 1.5 was was the length of this box oh my god oh my god are you guys ready to see what this looks like oh Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my gosh, I'm so excited to put up the Christmas tree. It's gonna be a little messy because look at all the glitter in this box. Also, it comes with a star. So I guess I can decide every year whether I want to go with the red star or the gold star. Okay, you guys, so the time right now is half past one. Um, there's gonna be load shedding probably around two. Oh uh, gosh, load shedding is the bane of our existences. Okay, so I just got done filming some content. Um, and yeah, I think I still have a bit more to do. Guys, would you believe me if I told you the time right now is 2.47. It is raining. It is so cold actually feeling a little cold um i should probably go put like warm pants on and socks because i don't like feeling cold um i can hear the thunder i closed the sliding door also because like it was very cold so i went to go take out some of the clothes off the washing line i'm calling it washing line clothes horse um and then i just moved it away from where the rain would have been because there's still some stuff that are still wet good morning everyone the last time i left you guys it was storming it was load shedding and it was just not a cute vibe i have since reorganized reset the christmas tree and then i also bought these different bubbles from checkers because i felt like i didn't think that this tree was going to be so tall so yeah i thought it was going to be a small tree and then it didn't end up really being a small tree so yeah i'm currently boiling the kettle so i can have some water to drink the lounge is basically a mess because i was filming here last night i filmed till like the early hours of the morning um just because i wanted to get the content done and i was supposed to go for a nail appointment today but that had to get rescheduled um so yeah i am going to edit my contents in for approval make myself a cup of coffee first and then I'll show you guys the Christmas tree and all of that good stuff and yeah I think I'm gonna leave my Christmas tree looking a bit sad this year um, when I say sad I mean not looking completely sad I just need to change the place where this one bubble is hey everyone 
everyone it's me again the time right now is half past four i'm currently waiting for some footage to export and then i've got to do more content but while we are waiting i figure we might as well sort out this little okay sorry the background is just very messy let me show you guys up close we might as well sort out this little situation yeah how cute by the way this was a candle that one of my clients gifted me um and yeah it's just so stunning and i think tamron makes it on instagram Good morning, everyone. Happy. There's a child in the background. Happy Tuesday. It is the 29th of November. I know I have been so MIA. Let me put you guys in better lighting because, wow. So, yeah, it is the 29th of November. I know I haven't chatted with you guys in a while. I know it has been crazy. Um,. The last time I saw you guys on the vlog, I was setting up my Christmas tree. I was trying to vlog in between, but then my camera was just so full. And yeah, it was just... It was chaos, to be honest. I made a little trip to KZN because I had a friend of mine, an acquaintance of mine, who booked me for her wedding makeup. And it was kind of an excuse for me to travel to KZN because... I had never done a drive by myself to KZN, so I drove for the first time to KZN. It was so good. As long as you have good music, I feel like you'll be good. And I really enjoyed my trip overall. Such a beautiful client to work with and such beautiful family members as well to work with. So that was amazing. And um, yeah. Um, so honored that people actually think of me um, to do their makeup and so blessed so blessed for this life hopefully i can you know travel more and stuff like that but it just becomes very costly so i stayed with my parents i drove uh which cut costs i stayed with my parents um so it really wasn't bad at all um and that was pretty much it guys um what else I got a lip filler touch up. I think I got it last week. Last week, I think. Um, I did my nails. Kenzo nail, but I also have a pimple on my nose. Yesterday, I went to get my nails done by Kenzo Nail Bar. She's currently on maternity leave, but she opened for a limited time only. Um, so she actually came out of maternity leave to bless us with slaying nails. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going to use my gloss by Geno Cosmetics. Been really loving this gloss as of recently. So yeah, it has been a really good um, month. It's been busy though. So I have not had time to edit content, to vlog. Um, so it's been really crazy. The last time you guys also saw me, I was setting up my Christmas tree and i was filming a campaign and the campaign has already gone live um 
and then yeah things just got hectic after that um today is not so crazy uh because most of my work is done and i really wanted to just relax and have like a full off day even though like i'm still doing errands and stuff like i've been washing the clothes washing the dishes um putting stuff away i've had like a few christmas stuff start coming in like christmas orders that i placed during black friday for like family and stuff start coming in so that's great um <gasps> my cousin had a baby about a month ago not even a month ago he's a few days short of a month um so that's been amazing to just have a new baby in the family and she's such a chilled cousin like she just lets us go she, she she let us see him when he was like four days old and i saw him like about a week ago as well so it's it's just amazing to have like this new baby around and she lets me like you know feed him his bottle and change his nappy and it's like the best thing ever like i am in like pre-mummy land right now if you know what that i don't even know is that a thing i am like on cloud nine with this newborn baby and geez time is going so fast guys can you believe december is only a few days away oh. so yeah i'm gonna eat i'm actually starving maybe i should have like a little mukbang with you guys um should i no i'm just gonna finish the vlog and then i'm gonna eat um so yeah this is what has been crazy over the last this is okay what you see at the beginning of the vlog is what i've been up to and then there's just complete silence for a while because i have been hella busy and i'm gonna try to be back but i can't make any promises guys because it's just really really difficult sometimes to like you can film the content and you can have the best of intentions to film the content and upload it but by the time you make time to edit that content several weeks have passed so i just would like to ask you guys to be patient with me um follow me on my other um platforms like tiktok and instagram where i'm a little bit more active i think right now i'm more active on instagram i tried for a while to be most active on tiktok but yo tiktok also is tiring because it's like quick form fast content every time every day you need new content fresh content yo it's a lot so i am going to say thank you guys if you have come to the end of this vlog thank you so much for watching thank you guys for being patient with me throughout this time i know there have been a few impatient people like when are we getting another vlog it's very it gives me anxiety and i could have taken this day off but i knew there are people waiting for a vlog and i don't want to let you guys down like i have like i felt like i've let you down over the last month um so yeah let me get on to editing this vlog and i'm gonna have lunch i am gonna edit this vlog i've got laundry outside that i need to take off the line or clothes house rather and then i've got to pack all the newly acquired christmas items um oh i, I also set up my christmas tree as you guys may have seen um so i don't think i told maybe i did i had to buy new bubbles but I'll, I'm pretty sure I showed you guys what bubbles I needed to buy. Um, it's been so long ago, I don't even know what I spoke about in the last vlog. So yeah, I just need to tidy up the house a little bit because it is chaos. I was going to events and places and stuff, so I was changing my bags and all of that stuff. And it's basically sitting on my couch. <laughs> so I need to go put those things away. Uh, also went to Clicks Beauty Playground and I got a whole goodie bag so also need to put the goodie bag away. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope that I can create some wholesome fun content for you guys in the festive season. Although I'm going to be working for most of it. But I'll try and vlog the best that I can where I can. Um, and yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to slay all day every day with and without makeup. And from me and my friend right here. I will see you guys in the next vlog. Bye-bye.